Does it smell good? Donde esta mi cabeza? Like, why it's still crawling. He took his first step. That's how, how Harlow um, was saying it before. Uh, this is my little travel outfit. I, I'm probably gonna be a little uncomfortable because I just put fake tanner all over, so it's gonna be like a little sticky and nasty in the car. But it's like chilly, but it's also gonna be hot later, so I always find that really difficult to dress for and dress the kids for. But I got this little hat at Walmart, and I have a tiny head, and it has this like little thing on the inside that like you can tighten, which is just like genius. So. We're about to head out. We're about to drop little one off at um, the uh, doggy doggy daycare. Um, yeah, you peed on, peed on that before. Don't you do it again? Uh uh, Bernie. She peed on the carpet, my the rug, the white rug in my closet. So all right, we're gonna pack everybody up. We're ready to go. Let's do this. We're going to Mexico um, for Day of the Dead. We have, oh, I'll show you the pictures that we are recreating. We're gonna try and do this every single year. So let me show them to you. So this one, we're gonna try and recreate. I have that exact onesie that I packed actually. And then this one, and then I need to create one with Wyatt like this, but Wyatt and I, so we'll have to figure out where we wanna do that. We just got here. Nick picked out a really cool spot. So the garage is back there, kitchen and the ocean hey please do not go up the stairs honey because i don't want your brother to follow you okay can we get down I just said you. okay he's doing really good on these but these are still sketchy the let's see good job buddy good job it is so pretty though these are like bifold doors that just like open up and it is just like beautiful and we can go down here and everything yeah. Isn't it pretty? Yeah. The ocean? Yeah. These kiddos have a cough though. We do need to go get some cough medicine for these poor guys. It was like a really short drive though. Like <clears throat> it was only like 20 minutes past the border. So for us, it's only like an hour and 10 minutes to get here. Oh, that's the cupboard we don't need to be getting in. No, thank you. No, thank you. No, he can't have those, sweetheart. Can you not show those to him? Can you put those back where you found them? She found like a thing of like kids paint. I'm like, no. Oh, to her. oh, I thought the camera was facing you. I was like, I don't see it. <laughs> it's because I shaved it recently. Uh. <laughs> restaurant that Harlow's old nanny brought us to last time we were here. Oh, perfect. I actually have to use the restroom. Perfect timing. <laughs> Does it smell good? <laughs> They're so pretty. Daddy's gonna go potty. Let's see what Sissy's doing. Harlow, donde esta mi cabeza? <laughs> I'll see it. Where's, Where's my head? <laughs> Can you find it? You oh, help me find it. <laughs> Where's daddy's head? Where's my head? Where's my head? You'll find it? Help me find my head. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> you found it. You're so silly. This place is super cool. So this like little walkway goes around the whole outside and we were told that they walk their goats out here every now and then. So everyone that's eating can see them. Please be careful. But 
super cool and everything in here is just like so rad. Like such a cool building. Look out here. I think this is a place that has like a bathroom with like a really cool view. Like it just lightens up a little bit. Nick and I just the other day were talking about how <laughs> difficult like the age from like nine months, eight, nine months to like two years is. And I feel like it's even crazier and harder with boys. Like that time period where they can't tell you like what's wrong, what they want, that they want a sweater, that they want a water. Um, and they can't really like walk well, like why it's still crawling. He took his first steps, like I said in a recent vlog, um, on his 14 month birthday. But like, not that we're like wishing the time away. <laughs> oh, you can't see because they're a flash. Because they're like banging on the window right here. <laughs> um, not that we're like wishing the time away, like at all. But it is not my most favorite. Um, it's diff it's just difficult. Like there are definitely favorite moments and stuff. Like don't get me wrong. But it is a hard period. Like with Harlow, it's like so much easier. You can actually go out with her, reason with her, speak to her. Um, with Wyatt, I just like, like, he always wants to get down because he wants to crawl. He puts everything in his mouth. Like it's, it is a, it's a challenging age for sure. Like I don't know how people do it with like twins, like that same age, like 14 months, 12 months. Like I'm like, I don't even know, but they just turn a little heater on for us here. The sun is starting to set. It's just like, this property is just so beautiful. It's called um, La Media Luna. So if you're ever near K38, Rosarito, um, it's like this is a really cool like property. They also have like like I said earlier like goats and like chickens and all the stuff. It's just like a really rad like farm, um, and I think you can even stay here and they have like a little spa as well. So it's very cool. hot dog stand. We're about to go to dinner. There is no mirror in here. <clears throat> I did a little outfit change. So I'll just do a little pan down because I cannot find a mirror. So I don't know what this looks like. <laughs> I had Nick just take a picture for me. He's uh, black on black on black on black for the dinner, the dinner fit. Oh, oh, that was <laughs> not as heavy as it could have been. Okay, let's see how well I can throw it with my left hand. Actually, I'm gonna go underdog, here we go. <laughs> you pulling your pants down? What you doing? <laughs> All right, Harlow, grab your purse. We're gonna go to dinner. cheese. Oh, cheese. We're gonna go to dinner. Can you grab your purse? Say, brother, may I have my purse? May I have my purse? Thank you.
breakfast here. How cute is this place? Dirt on the ground, I love it. Are you sitting in your little seat? Mm -hmm. It's like half inside, half outside. It's so cute. This salsa is so flipping good. I think they have green, <clears throat> they put green onions in it, I think. They brought us little burritos and this as a little appetizer. And I'm gonna see if I can buy some of the salsa. This stuff is so freaking delicious. Got a little espresso. I don't know about you, but I always have a million different drinks. Oh. We just got home. We have a mess to clean up. <laughs> no one wants to nap. Uh, so I just went down and got the chicken eggs, which those girls were busy. Look at this. There's a lot of eggs in there. So I'm trying to like throw some laundry in, kind of clean up because this house was a bit of a disaster as you can kind of see like around me when we left. So <sighs> today's Sunday though. So tomorrow will be a good day with the kiddos out of the house and I can kind of organize. I'm trying to get a head start on it now. I just like, I actually want to go take a nap, but I hate when my house is messy. So we're going to work on getting some laundry done and doing all this, but we had so much fun in Mexico. Kudos to Nick for picking that super rad location. It was awesome. And we had a great time and I have so many pictures. I think we took like a million pictures. The place we went to for breakfast this morning, I was way too hungry to even show you guys, but highly recommend. Um, however, uh, you must know how to speak Spanish pretty well or use a translator because um, most of the people there don't speak um, much English, which obviously to be expected, you're not even in uh, America. So it makes sense, but I was struggling a little bit. I could say a few things. I was like, I do know how to ask for the check in Spanish. I also know how to ask for flat water in Spanish. I know some of the basics, but um, I'm going to try to clean this up a little bit and yeah, thanks for watching guys. Thanks for watching our trip to Mexico. And um, we'll see you soon. Have a good rest of your day and I hope you had a great weekend. And I hope you had a safe Halloween because by the time you see this, Halloween I think will have passed. Bye guys.